Even new at five, she was trapped by flames inside her bedroom. But San Antonio firefighters say her quick thinking saved her life and others. That fire started around noon on Neptune Street, not far from Lowell Middle School. Alicia Barrera shares details of the damages and the dangers that firefighters face as we head into the heart of this 100 degree heat wave. Billows of black smoke could be seen from downtown. And I heard like a bang. The source, a green roofed home engulfed in flames just down the street from Mrs. Rachel Sanchez's home on Neptune Street. And all of a sudden we just started hearing like pops and, you know, fire was just going up in the air. While neighbors rushed to call 911 and flames quickly destroyed a second home, those inside the greenhouse ran for their lives. There was a granddaughter that was in the back bedroom. She was trapped in there by the smoke and the heat. She was able to push out the AC unit and escape out of the window. Thankfully, the woman's two grandparents made it out moments before and no serious injuries were reported. An official cause has yet to be determined. Today's rising heat also played a big factor in firefighters immediately calling for that two alarm fire. This allows for them to take breaks in order to complete their full shift. We're monitoring a full set of vitals, pulse ops, putting them on monitors, making sure that we're checking everything and maybe even their glucose levels because they have another probably 20 hours to work. And Chief Hood says it's barely the start of a very hot and demanding week for the city's fire department. Alicia Barrera, KSAT 12 News.